Here are a few examples of top combat athletes who surprisingly have no or very little cauliflower ear. Gable Stevenson, Hodger Gracie, Tim Kennedy, Tynan Dalbra, Brian Ortega. Here's the exact opposite. It's pretty much a list of the worst cauliflower ear you'll ever see. Khabib Nurmagomedov, Colby Covington, Alexander Gustafson, Conor McGregor, Gary Tonin. It took smashing his ear with a UFC belt and using a meat mallet with Jorge Masvidal for Stevo to achieve his goal of obtaining cauliflower ear without training. Not really a badge of honor, but I guess that's pretty cool. According to a 2015 study published in the National Library of Medicine, cauliflower ear was found to increase the risk of hearing loss. They surveyed a sample of wrestlers with one damaged ear, two damaged ears, and no damaged ears, and performed audiometric examinations and looked at things like earwax production to determine a significantly higher amount of complications for people with cauliflower ears than without. Because of the study's findings, they also recommended that more athletes should be wearing headgear in the training room, but we're not going to do that.